Yo, what's good, everybody? In today's video, I'm going to be teaching you guys how I can actually win the solo cash cup, which is coming super soon to Fortnite. Real quick, before this video starts, though, please subscribe to the channel if you're new, because now we're on the road to 50k subscribers, and every single new sub is greatly appreciated. If you're a new sub, comment down below, hashtag new sub, and I will heart and reply to your guys' comments. Also, if you guys want to support me even more, if these tips and trick videos help you out at all, please use code KDOG in the item shop. It helps me to continue to make these videos. It helps me out a lot more than you guys think. Without further ado, let's get straight into this video. All right, so basically, the thing that you guys need to know, which is like some of the most important stuff, is it's obviously a solo only tournament but you also have to be in champion league to play in this cup so if you're actually on console i have a video on my channel which is basically like a tutorial video on how you can actually hit champion league on console so i'll leave that in the description down below and you guys can just go watch that video if you're on console and you need to hit champion league but basically like some of the best ways to hit champion league is just by playing solo arena and just like camping and trying to get like top 25 and top 15 every single game it's a pretty good way and pretty easy way to actually get it but if you're already in champion league then i'll give you some basic tips and some pretty good tips actually to actually hit this so basically for your first one to two games you want to make sure that you're still w king not w king too hard but trying to get like seven to eight to ten kills that's still going to be pretty good because obviously the players aren't going to be terrible because they're in champion league and it's still pretty early on in the season but also like they're not going to be bad or anything so if you are a good w keyer i recommend w king to try to get like a eight to ten kill win for your first game but if you're not the best fighter or if you're on console because this tournament is played with everybody so basically console plays with pc and like they just all play together so if you're on console or you're just not the best w keyer i recommend playing for placement because basically in this format you're still able to get 20 points for placement points so say you get like a win with zero kills you still get 20 points so basically i guess if you're in a higher elo lobby the lobbies are going to be a lot more stacked because everyone's in champion league they know how to play this and it's a solo cup so usually just less people fight in them so what you guys need to be practicing is scrim so if you guys need some scrim discords i'd recommend just going online trying to look for some like east opens or west opens or whatever server you play on just trying to find some scrims that host solos people like even if you just go into like a twitch stream or something it would be fine but just try to find someone that's hosting solo only scrims uh, like those are by far the best ways to help you the next thing is to not be nervous when you're playing and this is a really hard thing to do and like it's a really hard thing to like learn how to do but basically the only way you can get less nervous is if you play more in these tournaments and like you just play every single tournament and also if you just have like a mentality where it doesn't really matter like how you do but you're just gonna try to do your best and if you have a good mentality in this tournament then you'll definitely do better than someone that doesn't have a good mentality and like if you're just not raging you're just like taking a little break when you need to take breaks that should be one of the best ways to help you also just finding things that help you stay calm in certain situations like maybe it's like taking a deep breath or just like reorganizing yourself after you're in a fight or something or like even when you're in end game if you have someone that's able to like call your mats if you're on pc they can like screen share to them or something like that or finding ways that you can stay calm during the tournament basically if you do just play a lot of screams you'll get more used to playing in end games you'll get less nervous and it's by far one of the best ways to actually practice end games it's just by playing screams that's what all the pros do any single person that like asks gets asked like what they should do to get better everyone just has to play scrims so if you're a bad fighter then definitely playing solo arena and just w king every single person you find is one of the best ways if not the best way to get better at fighting especially in real game situations like you might think creative is a good way but honestly like your ping is so different between creative and regular games and also play styles is different between every single person so if you play a lot of solo arena it's by far one of the best ways to get better at fighting i'm going to go over a couple of the like places that you need to get to actually win money in this tournament so if you're on na west you need to get top 12 which is pretty difficult to do but if you just stay consistent you have a good first game and you keep a good mentality you should be able to do it next is for na east so basically for na east you need to get top 25 and then finally for eu you need to get top 50 in this cup to win money so eu is definitely like it's one of the bigger regions so it's not easier than any other region it's obviously going to be difficult and like the same amount of difficult as the other regions but other than that that is all for today's video so if you guys did enjoy the video please subscribe to the channel if you're new also use code kdog in the item shop if you want to support me even more but i'll catch you guys in the next video peace out